the C rating of a battery pack is a multiple that you use to, you, you multiply the capacity of the battery by the C rating and that gives you the maximum expected discharge rate in, in amps from, from that battery pack. And um, if you have a battery pack in an airplane and it doesn't give you quite the, the discharge rate that, that, you, that you hope for, that you need, uh, the obvious solution is to buy another battery pack with the same capacity that has a higher C rating. So the original, original one had a C rating of, of 20. You can go to 30 or, or, or 40. And, and that will work fine. The problem is that when you go to a, a higher C rating from like 20 to 40, the cost of that battery pack can go by a lot. You know, it's not proportional. And you know, you could easily pay 50% more for that doubling in C rating, but of course the capacity hasn't increased. So a, a, another solution that I want you to think of is instead of going for a higher C rating, you go for a higher capacity. Because again, the, the maximum discharge rate is just the multiple of those two values. So if you double the C rating or double the capacity, you're still going to get a doubling on the, on the maximum discharge rate. And, and the reason why this might make sense is because those 20C batteries are relatively cheap. And, you know, and, and of course, you may not need a doubling, you might just need a 50% increase. And, you know, doubling in the size of the battery, you know, might be an issue with some airplanes, but a 50% increase is probably okay, it's probably not going to be a problem. And, but then, you know, of course, you, you're, if, if you increase the capacity by 50%, you, you're probably looking at 50% longer flight times, which is nice. But it's, it's the bang for the buck is going to be much better than if you had increased the C rating by 50%. Hope that made sense and something to think about next time you uh, need to upgrade your battery pack size.